Hello and welcome to Software Resources for Translators. With our short tutorials, we're gonna see how to use different features of translation software. Today we're gonna be working with SEL Studio 2011 SP2 and we're gonna see how to export a file for external revision. I'm gonna go to my desktop where I have my uh, folder that I created with the files that are processed already and going back into the studio interface I have the bilingual file open we're gonna have to choose file Ex export for external review press next here we can choose the layout uh, of the revision right since this is going to be uh, seen in the target format we can choose to see it side by side or top down I'm gonna do top down like in the good old workbench let's go to finish when it's done we're gonna close we're gonna say yes to see where where the folder is go to the target language folder and open the document for example if I'm the editor and I do not have access to studio or if I want to just see it in the target format this is a great tool so let's do some changes here uh, we're gonna change this into a plural we're gonna add a comment here if we go to the revision tab we're gonna see that the track changes option is on gonna add a comment and I'm gonna say please add SR4T we're gonna save since these are going to be all our changes we'll close the file and back into studio we're gonna go to file update from external review and we're gonna choose the revision file we go to next we go to add specific specific file if we choose folder we're gonna put the content of the complete folder here it doesn't make a difference because we only have one but sometimes you need to do that to make the difference you know we go to next and then we just choose finish when the process is complete we're gonna go back to the bilingual document we have to choose yes <coughs> and we're gonna see that our uh, studio interface shows us the changes uh, made by the editor okay in this case uh, it was the same person which is me but you usually have someone else do it here you have the changes with the track track changes options on and here if we go close to the highlighted word we see the comment uh, which reads please add SR4T what, which uh, we're going to do we'll confirm the, the segment with um, control enter or however you like and if we want we can accept the changes here or in the target segment I'm going to just save this file go uh, shift F12 to save the target and give it a different name if I go to the export folder which I showed you at the beginning I'm going to see the target file and we see that here we have the changes too we go to uh, the revision tab the track changes options is off now we go to accept all changes in document this we can just erase because it was already uh, changed we can do a uh, spell check and when we're ready to uh, to go we can save the file and it's ready to send to to a customer so that's it for now I hope you will find this useful please let us know if you have any comments or questions and we'll be back soon with more tutorials thank you bye